Hello, Divine Masculine. Welcome to your full moon in Libra lunar eclipse energy reading. In this energy reading, I'm going to be tapping into the full moon energy on what it's bringing to the Divine Masculine Collective. So this will be a general collective reading for the Divine Masculine Collective that I channel for. So I just want you to sit back, relax, close your eyes if you feel guided to, allowing the messages to come forth as they're supposed to, as spirit intends, taking only what speaks directly to your soul and releasing what doesn't. So first I want to tap into the energy of this full moon lunar eclipse in Libra. So the full moon in Libra is essentially about a win-win outcome being forecast. So Divine Masculines, I feel you are wanting to make peace with your past. So Libra is an air sign. Air signs are about balance and communication. They are Libra is also tied to the Justice Tarot card. So the Justice card is telling you it's time to balance the scales, to have this karmic justice, and to allow this karmic cycle. And perhaps if you have done something to the Divine Feminine that has hurt her in the past, and this karma has come back to you full circle, this full moon is going to help you release that energy. Because the color pink is about the heart chakra. It is about self-love. And the way you make peace with your past is to find the strength to forgive. To forgive yourself, to forgive the Divine Feminine, and anyone else that you feel that you need to give forgiveness to. Because you really have to let go of what is falling away. So Divine Masculines, I feel, are going through a tower moment right now. And this full moon energy is telling you that when you can make the decision to do the work, you are able to allow what doesn't serve you to fall away. So you have to see the Divine Feminine through the eyes of love and to see it from her perspective. She has always seen things through your perspective, but if you saw it through her perspective, you may gain a sense of clarity. So I feel for a lot of Divine Masculines, you do have to make a firm decision on what you want. You can't be in limbo. You can't be like, should I stay? Should I go? What do I do? What do, where do I go? You have to make a decision because that's what the energy of this full moon is about. It's about making decisions and taking the masks off and being honest with yourself to focus on you for a while. Maybe you just need to spend some time with yourself so you can just understand that when you throw the eclipse energy into this, you are having a conclusion and it's within reach. So this card is telling you that any door that you shut now, whether it's on your divine feminine, this divine feminine from the past, if you choose to shut the door, if you choose not to make an effort, this door is not going to reopen. This opportunity is gone. So you have to get back on track. You have to issue forgiveness to her, to you, and really get into meditation, Divine Masculine. I really feel that's going to help you. It's going to help you just not want to be in control and to let things unfold naturally. Because when you allow things to unfold naturally, you essentially allow yourself to find a balance. And finding a balance is very much like balancing the scales, letting this full moon illuminate to you just how you can just co-create with the universe because that's really what this is about when you're wanting to manifest you are essentially wanting to be the co-creator and you want to co-create with spirit so now i want to open openly channel how the divine masculine is feeling with the full moon energy so he is feeling like the emperor the emperor the emperor is is having solar plexus chakra issues so solar plexus chakra is the middle chakra it's located in the belly it is connected to the color yellow see the solar plexus chakra as your middle chakra as your battery when that chakra is open and balanced and activated it essentially 
keeps the other chakras, your lower chakras, the sacral and the root, which are the bottom, they keep them going. It also keeps the upper chakras, the heart, the throat, the third eye, and the crown going. So when this chakra is imbalanced, if it's shut, if it's just closed off, your other chakras are going to get imbalanced and you're going to cause issues. So Divine Masculines, for you to make peace with the past, you have to connect to your solar plexus chakra. The Emperor is card number four in the Major Arcana. Number four is telling you an opportunity to balance this out is coming. The bird on this card is telling you it's time to fly high, it's time to fly free. You have to be free as a bird now. So the song that's coming through for you is Free Bird by Leonard Skinner. I'm as free as a bird now. It is time for you to free yourself. Free yourself from the past and to free yourself essentially from what's holding you back. So now I want to see what changes need to be made. So what changes does the Divine Masculine need to make? So changes that the Divine Masculine needs to make with this full moon energy. What can you tell us, spirit, spirit guides, ancestors, and angels? So Divine Masculine, for you to reach the Two of Cups, union with another person, you have to be the King of Cups. You have to master your emotions and the ship behind the, the man on this card is telling you, you are either going to close the door on this Divine Feminine once and for all or you're going to get on that ship and sail away with her. It is going to be completely up to you, but you have to balance your emotions first. You have to get a sense of what you want because your divine feminine is the queen of pentacles. So she is very 3D based. She is very much looking for something that is 3D based. She could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Doesn't have to be. I'm also getting water energy with her. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, doesn't have to. What I'm getting is that she has mastered her emotions and that's why she is the Queen of Pentacles. So this Ace of Cups that you wanted to give her or maybe you're thinking you should have given her, is it too late for some of you Divine Masculines? Yes, it is. Divine Feminines have decided to move on without you. And for others, there is a chance for you to come back. But this Ace of Cups, you can give to yourself and then see what happens. Because you have to release the burdens of the past. That's why you have to make peace with the past. So that's a big change that you have to do. You have to understand that going forward means you face your shadow side, you embrace your light side, and you just go where the wind takes you. You have to understand that, yes, there has been hurt, there has been heartbreak, there has been anger. She may not be willing to let you back in, but when you can apologize, when you can forgive, and she has forgiven you too, and she forgave you, not to excuse what happened, but she forgave you so she could move on. So the Four of Wands shows me that you can make peace with the past, and that's going to bring you to union. Now for some Divine Masculines, this could be union with self, this could be union with the Divine Feminine, or it could be union with another person. So don't hold on too tight, Divine Masculine. Let it go. Drop it all. Release your control. Release your hold. And allow things to just come full circle as they're supposed to. So now I want to get you some guidance. So let's get some guidance messages, please, for the Divine Masculine Collective. All right, I have four cards that want to come out. So we have the Twin Flame card. So Divine Masculine, you could have a Twin Flame connection with this Divine Feminine. So for those that are Twin Flames, your passion ignites, the flame still burns, but is the flame strong enough to bring this back? There is a passion that the two of you share with one another. 
A magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. Enjoy it. Is this a good thing? Is this just energy? So Divine Masculine, this is where you have to trust your power because you instinctively know what is right for you and you have the power to say no or to walk away at any time. So you have the power to make that decision. So whatever you decide, whatever you choose, once you make peace with the past, you're going to bring yourself to freedom. You're going to see that there's nothing stopping you. The path is clear if you want it to be. And I'm even hearing another song. This is by, I think, Jefferson Starship. Nothing's going to stop us now. That song has a special message for a lot of Divine Masculines right now. So nothing is stopping you. So you want romance in your life. Where is Cupid's arrow going to strike? Where are you pointing it and where are you going to shoot it? This is where you have to make a decision. But you have to make a decision based on what your heart wants. So let's see what possible future energy, what the future holds for Divine Masculines with this full moon in Libra lunar eclipse energy. What is the future hold? What can you tell us about the future with Divine Masculine, please? So the Three of Pentacles shows me, Divine Masculine, you are going to co-create with Spirit. You are going to heal the pain of the past. You're going to make peace with your past. And that's going to shift you into the Seven of Cups, where you're going to have many different ways, many different options. So don't get fixated on one way to make peace with the past. Ask the universe to show you. Another song coming through for you, Masculine, is Show Me The Way by Styx. That song is a specific message for Divine Masculine. Show me the way. Ask Spirit to show you the way back to becoming the Emperor. And not only becoming the Emperor, staying the Emperor. What is that, what is that gonna bring him? Oh, I'm getting chills. The Chariot and the Fool. Two movement forward major arcana cards. You will take that leap of faith. You will move forward. Cancer season is coming through because chariot is tied to the zodiac sign cancer or it could be you have a divine feminine who is a cancer sun moon or rising but wow the lovers you're gonna move forward towards love whatever you decide whatever you want when it comes to love you will be the king of cups in the future you are going to master your emotions you are going to bring clarity to yourself you are going to understand that nothing is going to stop me. I am free as a bird because I let the universe show me the way. So I do hope that this energy reading for Divine Masculine for the full moon in Libra lunar eclipse has brought you clarity and guidance. If it did, drop a comment below to let me know. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And if you are subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. Make sure you have the bell notification set so you can be notified when new content is posted on my channel. If you are interested in booking with me, go to the description box below. You will see my full list of services, my links on how you can book with me, and all the ways you can connect with me outside of YouTube. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. Love and light to you.